Hey everyone, this is Jenny Streeby with Confessions of a Hairstyles, and I couldn't be more thrilled because I have Stephanie with SN Makeup Artist, and she's gonna be doing a lot of collaborations with me, so be on the lookout, and she actually has her own YouTube channel, and the link is gonna be below, so please subscribe to her channel and check it out. And today, we're gonna do something really fun for you ladies. So we thought this is the perfect time to show you guys how to get a classic makeup look and pair it with a classic hair look. So Stephanie's gonna go ahead and take it away and show you how to achieve a really beautiful classic makeup look on our model Taylor here. Hi guys, I'm Stephanie with SN Makeup Artist. I'm super excited to be here today and I'm really looking forward to showing you this beauty look. I'm also going to segue this beauty look into one of my favorite trend looks as well. We're seeing a lot of really beautiful, natural, dewy skin with soft highlights. So I did a very soft coverage of foundation on her and then one of my favorite things to use for a highlight are the MAC pigments. Naked, Life, um, Vanilla, those are all very beautiful. I used that pigment and I placed it right along her cheekbone here, right along the eyelid, the brim of the nose, above the bow of the the lip and a little bit on the chin. Those are all the places the sun naturally hits you so you're gonna have that nice natural dewy glow. And then the main areas of like classic glamour beauty makeup, you're gonna to wanna to touch the brows, the lashes, and the lips. But also honing in on that natural aspect of the trend, instead of doing false lashes, I just made sure she had a strong highlight, good mascara. And then for the brow, I actually used a dark espresso colored eyeshadow from MAC called Charcoal Brown. And I used a lip brush as opposed to an eyeliner brush. And what's cool about it, the round edge helps you create that really nice strong arch so as you can see that round edge you can place it on the skin and just kind of pull it down the tip of the brush is very thin and it's a synthetic brush so you get a full coverage you can actually come down to the bottom create a strong line fill in the body and then you can get a nice end as well very simple very fast one brush and that's it so now we're gonna segue into the most important part of the glamour look, the lip. And I'll be honest, I rarely ever just throw one lipstick on somebody and call it a day. I like to mix, I feel like you get a lot of dimension. So the two shades that I chose today are Diva Lipstick from MAC, which as you can see is this gorgeous, almost like purple undertone cranberry red. So it's not brown, it doesn't have a lot of orange in it, it's very moody for fall, which we love. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take Heroin Lipstick, which I know a lot of you love, it's a really popular shade from MAC. We're gonna blend that on top of it. So it can still be fun and bright and poppy for fall. And we're gonna get a layer of the Diva all over, starting in the center of the lip and then pressing out towards the lip line so you get that really nice crisp line. You don't necessarily need a lip liner. I'm actually really loving that aerate look of a lip where it's still defined but not pencil defined. So very similar to the lip that I wore today. And the lip products that I have on today is actually a mixture of Diva and Violetta from MAC. So it's a little bit different but very similar to the look I'm doing right now on Taylor. So as you can see, I take the majority of the color towards the center and then I very softly kind of bring it out toward the edge so I can get a nice strong line. You go ahead and close for me. Now we can kind of adjust where we need a little bit more color, so I'll grab some more product. As you can see, I've got the entire lip filled in. We've got that one solid shade of color, and you can kind of see what I mean with that nice solid line, but not the pencil look. It's still very soft. Now for the fun addition, we're gonna take the Heroin Lipstick. A lot of people were having fun with this shade during spring, but I really love it for fall. Warm up your dark, brighten your dark colors by adding a little bit of this right into the center and see how it gives it this really fun, purpley kind of a pop. Instead of it be just being a true red, it's kind of taking that really classic, modern like, look and making it modern, adding a little bit more of a pop of color to it. Heroin is one of my absolute favorites. It's gorgeous by itself, but I love, love, love incorporating it into my other lip colors. Just patting it right in the center and then lightly dragging it out to the outer corners. We're gonna take it to the top lip. You can really see it there. As you can see, this is a very classic, timeless look, but I've definitely altered it to be just a little bit more modern. It's not your you know, classic red lip. It's got a little bit more of that plum undertone to it, but with a little bit of a pop. Fresh skin, brows, lashes, lips, and you're gonna be good. Thank you guys so much for having me. I hope you guys stay tuned for further collaborations with Jenny, and I really look forward to being here. Thank you so much.